or Justin Soup, as you guys also might know me. I have a super special unboxing today. It is Watcha! It's the Peter McKinnon Nomadic backpack. Now it is only the travel backpack and a few other the cases, so the memory card, the battery, and the filter case. I did not get the other compartment, the accessory case, and or the cube pack. So without further ado, let's get into this. Man, I just can't believe. <laughs> oh wow, this is actually really freaking sweet, and I didn't, uh, I didn't think that I was gonna be actually seeing this stuff up top right away. I thought it was gonna be in the backpack. So um, I've watched a lot of reviews and stuff, so I'm not super amazed by my first impression, but nonetheless, I still do love every part of this. Um, so right now I got one of the cases, it might be a battery case. These bags are like really soft, they're really, they're really quality. Uh, oh, anti-mold sticker. Oh yeah, so this is a battery case. Oh, wow. Like everyone's been doing. Oh wow, that's <laughs> that's really cool. And then inside you should find the stickers, which I do plan on using for my batteries. I just think it's a nice little uh, piece for the combo. And that's the battery kit. I mean, there's nothing much. You got three battery holes, so I might be getting another one of those in the future. Love it. Uh, next on, I believe this is the filter case. Oh, oh wow. They have a lot of these. Oh, they have a lot of these. Um, they're moisture control packs, I guess is what you'd call them. Uh, so the filter case. Oh, wow. And I actually do have one filter I can put in here real quick. So I took this filter out. This is a polarizer for my 16 to 35, and I'm gonna just test this out real quick. fits like a glove and I'm really I'm really happy you have a lot of space well not as much as I thought I thought this was double-sided so you only have six plus you could put extras in here if you really wanted to so that's that put that to the side and then oh oh there is there's there's one more oh, actually I thought I was gonna be pulling out the bag now no this is the memory card holder over there and more of these oh wow that's a lot different than what I thought it was gonna be in person these little packs packs are what I really didn't pay attention to and it says that you can just it says you have to use your thumb to push this out I don't know it's not working like it should be or maybe I'm doing it wrong Let's try a different. There we go. There we go. Yeah, you gotta be either just do it a certain way, or you gotta be really gotta be make sure you're really on that edge right there of the card to push it up. But still, still a cool feature. So you have room for six, nine. Ooh, no, you have room for six regular SD cards, and then room for two of the CF cards, and then. As everyone has said, micro SD. So that's really cool. And then again with the magnet snaps. I really like that. That's probably one of my favorite features because you don't have to worry about unbuttoning anything, unzipping anything. It's just boom, you're open. Um, and then finally, not least, we have the backpack. And I've been waiting so goddamn long for this. Let's get into it. Um, so if you would notice the Fly the Flag Peter McKinnon logo. The one thing I noticed through the other unboxes in the logo was this little accent, I guess you would say, where the blades cross. And then you also have this little accent. And I think those, the designer wanted those to go together, but I'm not sure. Um, I just thought that was a cool little thing to point out from the design uh, perspective of this logo. I never really saw it uh, in person before besides on Instagram. And then We'll do. Wow. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> um, 
Oh, snap. I didn't realize that you you get the, you get the bottom strap if you really want it. Um, that's really cool. I was hoping that I would get it. And, I oh, mean, I just really got to... I really just gotta feel this thing. I mean, it's different than my backpack. It's my backpack's not a, a travel case. And uh, I've, yeah, I'd, fucking, hey, holy crap! This is this is really cool, guys. This is really cool. We'll take this back uh, strap out. This is why not? Um, probably won't be using it anytime soon. Maybe on my hiking adventures. But wow, guys, that is a solid strap. All right, so let's actually get into this bad boy. So we'll unzip this pocket, and everyone says that there is this cool little fly the flag um, that also clicks down and up. Um, really don't know how I feel about that future uh, feature yet being so close to the outside of the backpack. I just I get skeptical about people when I don't put things in places like this, but uh, you almost wouldn't notice it. Unless you know the bag, you know like what the bag holds, you wouldn't notice it if you're just going in trying to slip in, unless you're, it's unstrapped, but it looks like it's pretty good there. So let's get to the next pocket. Oh, huh, that is the next pocket. So the next pocket is um, the extra room for your uh, space to put your luggage and or any other things that you want to carry. And we'll get into that pocket right here. And then, oh, didn't do it all the way. There we go. Oh, yo, nice. And then this just comes like that. And then also because of that, you have a lot more room versus, uh, where's that? So, regular amount of room, don't really have any room, you can fit maybe a couple shirts in there, versus um, versus this, and that's a lot more room. I can't wait to try it out this weekend, um, it's going to be a lot of fun going to Wisconsin, so that will be perfect. Zip that back up. Yeah, and then we have this, ooh, ooh, really nice. I didn't even realize what I was grabbing. Really nice zippers right here, guys. And then what you got here is a side pocket. Ooh, and, oh, it's the Velcro that stays on there. So I don't know if I really use this, my backpack currently. This is a current pocket that you have to get everything from is your side pockets. So put that back. And then, I'm ready. Oh wait, this too. I'm gonna put my tripod in here, but you can put water bottles in here. You also got a strap. I'm going to grab it. Ooh, whoa, 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 this strap. It's probably my favorite. Um, normally never grab backpacks like that, but that's definitely gonna be my favorite. It's just so cushiony. It's, it's cushiony, it's soft, it's, it's everything that you need. Um, so, let's get into the actual backpack. That's right up here. Wow, Peter McKinnon, you have made this bag something else. Um, and then I get the tripod or water bottle um, holders for the outside of the bag. So you can go around the front here or you can just extra to hold stuff on here move those out of the way. Oh, whoa. Pocket. PM pneumatic. Labeled all over. Um, I want to leave these like this because I really think that um, that's how I want them for right now. Um, wow. Just, wow. <clears throat> Zip it back up. I currently have both my cameras working right now, so I can't put all my gear in there. Um, otherwise, I would. But I will 
definitely be posted on Instagram about this bag, um, about what, how I'm setting it all up, how I want it set up, how it works for me, um, and then you also have another one, another little pocket right here to put on to a roller case. Um, so that's about it guys, uh, that's what I ordered. I am looking forward to ordering the cube pack and the accessory pouch, I just want the whole kit. I didn't realize that Peter McKinnon and Nomadic had the whole thing available on the site. I saw that a few pieces were out of stock when I ordered, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Enjoyed the B-roll, enjoy the backpack, I hope you get it yourself. I cannot shout out Peter and the Nomadic team enough, they did an amazing job on this backpack. Even though it's my first review of it, I'm definitely going to enjoy the hell out of it. I think it's exactly what I need. It's travel, it's photography, and you... So, if you guys enjoyed this video, or enjoy any of the other videos, please hit that subscribe button, follow button, like button, leave a comment down below what you think I'm doing right, what you think I'm doing wrong, and I'll see you guys until next time. I am J Media. Peace out, guys. <laughs>